Hello there you beautiful people and welcome back to my gaming series and today I'm playing Mars Warlogs That's right you motherfuckers now this is apparently Fallout on Mars in space And I was like why the fuck would I not give that a go Personally it seems more like The Witcher to me But you know what fuck it I'll give it a go Because it seems pretty fucking good And I did want to do this one ages ago but I couldn't get the fucker working And so once again I never really thought I'd end up in the middle of the war, but didn't really understand how. Politics was never my thing, and guild rivalries were always over my head. I had my own problems, more along the lines of acne and girls. Now I look back, I realize the fact not much was going on in my life was a good thing. There was always someone around to talk to, we didn't have to do a thing. Then one day, the soldiers came and got me and a bunch of other guys from around there. They wanted us for the company. At first, I was proud of my soldier uniform and the weapons they gave us. Then, I caught on. War's got nothing to do with being a hero. It's just about crawling forward with blood everywhere. Days of searing heat jammed into makeshift. Stinking trenches teeming with rats. So tired we could hardly stand but still couldn't sleep. Shaking, thinking what was going to hit us in the night. Nighttime meant marches from hell. Stepping in blood and shit. Herded around like cattle by dim-witted officers who kept sending dozens of idiots like me off to get butchered. All the time shouting at us like it was our fault. Idiots who pissed themselves when they saw the enemy blades and cried like babies just thinking about having to kill again. Could have gone on like that for ages, until it was my turn to get killed. Except, I got captured with a bunch of other guys I hardly even knew. They rounded us up and shoved us into a cattle car, jammed in like mutants. And they sent us way over to the other side of the lines. Can't really remember if it was day or night. I completely lost track of time. Pretty much lost track of everything. You are now in Camp 19. If you watch your step, we will get along just fine. Prisoners to Camp 19. Get off the train and stand in line. Then they shook us out, lined us up. This one guy crying his eyes out. You're about to meet the sand pit. I want every one of you clean within the hour. You will then be taken to the registration office. You will inform them of what you know how to do, and you will be assigned a post and a bunk. Now, get going. 
Fall out! He wanted us to clean up. Not such a bad idea. So we had a sand shower. Check it out, guys. Fresh meat. Good to see. I was starting to get tired of fucking the same asses. Hey, you're not bad, dickweed. <laughs> Pretty little girl eyes. <laughs> What do you want? Your share? This bitch is mine. I saw her first. Unless you've got some idea about taking me on, she's mine. Looking for trouble or what? Tough guy, huh? Fucking retard. Ha! <laughs> if you want to check out the scenery, just set yourself down somewhere. I always like to help people out. Right, guys? Don't know when to stop, huh? You got something to say? Say it! <laughs> Nobody speaks mouse here, dickweed. But if you're looking for trouble, you came to the right place. We're not gonna put up with some retard pissing us off. <sighs> not so smart, you know. Coming after me like that. Retards like you need to be put down like dogs. Bet you're an even bigger bastard than me. I get all choked up just thinking about that poor little bitch. Asshole. Forget it, guys. This guy's a skin job. No point staying in the line of fire. Um, thanks for helping me out. No fucking welcome, mate. We don't want you to get bummed now, do we? Forget it. It's over. Couldn't just stand by and watch him do something like that. You okay? I'm better. Kind of weird, actually. I feel better than I have for a long time. Thanks again. I'm gonna pick the last option. I think. Don't ever say thank you until you know what, why you're doing it. Well, don't thank anyone until you know who they are. Now, if you don't mind, we need to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> this place stinks. Okay, I'm with you. Okay, it looks like we've got some fucking gameplay. Okay, so... Here we are. This is Mars Warlogs. And I'll tell you what... I was really looking forward to this. Like I said, I wanted to play it ages ago, but it didn't fucking work. This is, of course, the prequel to the game known as the Technomancer. Now, I know what you're thinking. Don't turn the video off. Yes, the Technomancer. Apparently, it's not that fucking good. I'm probably going to give it a go. I don't fucking know. A lot of people like it. A lot of people don't. So it's hard to tell what the fuck people actually want. As for this one, this is kind of universally accepted as, you know, it's a fucking good game. It goes along with some of the others. Basically, The Witcher, you know, the, goes along that sort of combat route. What I can... I can understand. Uh, so yeah, hopefully it's a good fucking game. That oh, seems pretty shit. all right. This stuff is finished. I'll never be able to fix it here. Can't be that guy was gonna bomb that young bastard. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh shit! Some shit kicking off here. All right then, Dicker. Let's see what you got. I'm scared of some cutscenes, so I'll shut my mouth. 
You have fun with her? Hope you didn't spread her too much. Meantime, me and my buddies, we figure we don't like your attitude. You may be a retard, but we're not gonna put up with that kind of shit from a nutcase who don't know good enough to open his mouth when he has to. So, we're gonna party, see? Yep, I see. Yeah, mate, me and my fucking friend here, we ain't getting bummed. Fuck you, bitch. Little fucking little rent bastard, fuck off. Don't get cocky, so fuck off. Yeah, I'll kick your ass, you fat cunt. The dirty fat bastard, fuck him. Well, that's what he'd want, so the dirty fat cunt, string him up instead. I quite like the fucking combat in this game, though. It's, it's really fucking... Ah, oh, wait a second, it's like Batman, isn't it? That's where I recognise this fucker from. I was getting the Mad Max kind of vibe from this game. Anyone played that? I might do that one as well. That was a pretty good game. No, basically, I think it follows a sort of third person action brawler sort of combat mechanics. Similar to the Witcher and Mad Max in style. Yeah, I'd say that's a good, a good way of describing it. Fallout on Mars. I'm not sure if I'd agree with that, really. The Witcher on Mars? Yeah, I'd probably agree with that fucking one. I originally thought this was connected to the Red Faction series. Of course, made famous by THQ. But aren't you from is it THQ? Yeah, THQ. And um, Yeah, I never gave them fuckers a go. Apart from one to play two player with my partner. Aside from that, I never actually gave them a proper goal. Mainly because the shooting games don't fucking like them. That's shit, there's Fatty. Little bastard, dirty fat You're bastard. Yeah, fucking gay Eddie. How'd you end up here? The war, I guess, same as everyone. You might not believe me, but I've seen things. I know how to look after myself now. It's just that, let's just say, I needed some time to find my feet. Anyway, now you're up and about. You might just be useful to me. Not as your bitch, I hope. Why? You applying? Actually, I was more interested in someone who could help me get out of here. Can't do it on my own, but with an extra set of hands. Huh. Let's go to the mess. I think we need to have a talk. Without interruptions. All right, I'll follow you. Well, you either do or you don't. There's only one fucking way about it. What the hell are you doing out here? Just wanted to tell you, everyone's talking about how you took out the fat guy. He was embarrassing the entire Aurora army. Here, take this. A little thank you. Huh, thanks. Oh, fucking righty then. So, this is Mars. Kind of desolate in the red fucking planet that you uh, kind of figured it would be. Experience gain, congratulations, you just went up your first level. Press K to check your skill trees, blah blah blah, map press M. Press 
this top to display it. Ooh, that's fine. Okay. Here we fucking go. So. Oh shit, another fucking cutscene. I don't know what you did. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. He's on guard in the next block. Guess he wants to talk to me about the fat guy. Thanks for the info. Yes? And thank you for the free shit, mate. Nice one. Crack the tube inventory, use the eye to open the inventory and equip row with any item from the weapons and armor tabs. Okay. Yeah, definitely Mad Max kind of vibe. That that's almost taken straight from there. Even though Mad Max was made after this, so technically that would be the one ripping off this. Crack the tube. It'd be better than a fucking broken glass bottle. Now like I said, I really like the idea of this game. So I hope it don't fucking suck. Bob was looking for us, eh? Okay, who the fuck is Bob and where the fuck is he? Oh, the fat guy. Yo, know, he fucked him up because he's a dirty fucking bumming bastard. The dirty gay bumming bastard. Yeah, that's, that's what we want to call that cunt. Such scrap metal. Okay. Fuck off, Innocence. Speaking of which, why the fuck is your name Innocence? I mean, that... That's just ass gonna get fucking bombed in prison. I mean, in my innocence, what the fuck are you thinking? If you have to pick your name when you go to prison in this world, don't pick a name like that's just fucking stupid. So, is this the way? No. So, so far, so fucking shit. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, but you know what it looks like to be a good game? I swear to god, most games follow the same formula these days, though, because this is a game that it seems like I've played loads. Even though I've never played it before, just follows too many of the similar constructs that modern games have. Basically, action brawler fucking mechanic made famous by the Arkham series. You know, it's good on paper, but when you play it over and over again, it just becomes fucking mundane. Like, for example, like I said, this reminds me of Mad Max. I played that one, stopped fucking playing it after a while. Yeah, yeah. Reminds me of The Witcher. So the kid mainly due to its combat. No, it's aesthetic, obviously, because you're on Mars in thing. this one. And there's not really you can fucking do anything to do with Mars. Apart from big fucking red rocks. Oh, look. Fucking starting right some shit here. Yeah, fuck off, dickhead. Innocence! Protect yourself! Protect your anal cavity. That's why your name is Innocence, isn't it? Oh, you fucking pussy. Go and kill him already. See, that's how you do it, kid. Fucking watch next time. Dozy fucker. Character feats. Consult the character tab in the in-game menu. That's fine. Let's find somewhere quiet to sit. Right. Not exactly luxury, but everyone keeps this place neutral. You don't fight in the mess, so we can talk here. You... you really want to escape? You have a plan? Speak more quietly. I don't want everyone knowing. Sorry, I wasn't thinking. Well? You think I'd talk about escaping without having thought about it? Yeah, I got a plan. It'll take balls. You better not be scared of breaking a nail. I'm listening. There's only one way. Seeing how the camp's in the middle of nowhere. Steal the prisoner train. <laughs> you, you don't pull any punches, now, like I said, that's for sure. If you, if you look you at sure this game and you think you've played it before, mind. either just due to aesthetic or it? the fact that you've actually played I'm it, I can understand. You know, it does scared. seem a lot like every other fucking game, okay, like I mentioned okay. before. Crazy Though thankfully, right. it doesn't seem like Elix. <laughs> I mean, I have to admit, Elix was one I was looking forward to and ended up kind of letting me down in the end, which is a bit of a bastard, to be honest. I hope this doesn't do the same. So far, so good though. No, I'm quite, I'm quite liking it to be honest. It's because I'm quite enjoying it. But I need some time to enjoy it. I'm gonna say I like it so far, definitely. Fallout on Mars. The fuck wouldn't you want that? Though it's more akin to like I said, The Witcher on Mars. I wonder if that'd be a good tagline for the game. Witcher 3 on Mars. 
Possibly. Can I kill her? No, for fuck's sake. NPCs you can't kill, seriously? Oh my god, that that's that's got our fucking points to take away from it now, I'm afraid. That right there is a dick move. Fucking hate it when games do that. Well, I do like the aesthetic it's going for, really. This is pretty sweet. Yeah, except it's more food for those fucking bugs. Oh, right. Thanks, Cuts in. Once again, I'll shut my fucking they mouth. See you clean. in a minute. Great. It's just what I was expecting. What? What are they talking about? The drilling well keeps getting overrun by moles. And because the grunts have better things to do than get rid of the vermin themselves, they send prisoners in with weapons to take them out. I'm going to volunteer. That's right, you do the bastard. Get us fucking stabbed. Of course, I've got a plan. Fucking mentioning that like that. We fucking prison you, those are You're gonna have to work at making them believe you're some kind of genius electrician. I'm going with you anyway. Yeah, I was born with a light bulb in my mouth, didn't I tell you? Don't overdo it. They'll think you're a technomancer. Long as you don't start farting sparks, it should work. Come on, let's go. Hey, hi. We've never had the chance to talk. I heard about the fat guy. Takes balls, I gotta say. Apparently, the guy pissed himself. I'm Jay. And if I can do anything for you... I'm Roy. Actually, I just wanted some information. I knew it. I knew it. Come on, give, man. You know the guards here? Of course. I'm one of those who has been here the longest. I was a scout and got caught at the start of the war. You know, in the end, they're just like us. They're the good guys and they're the assholes. Bob's a great guy, for example, but you already know that, right? Yeah, he's not like the others. The rest of them really play by the book. Abundance has these ideas. Oh, don't try and tell me you prefer Aurora's bullshit. Or you wouldn't be called Roy, right? And they're scared shitless of their Technomancer. They obey, yeah. Maybe more than us, too. Oh, do you want me to go to the crew to send with you those cunts? And they're scared shitless we'll have to go with the last one, yeah. You just have to make them believe you're an actual Not ball electric kid. Not the most guy in the world, but... What do you expect from a Technomancer, huh? You're not kidding. That's it for now. Thanks for the tip. Oh, fucking right in. Now, like I said, the Technomancer is a sequel to this. Making this the prequel of the Technomancer. And that's pretty cool. You know, a lot of people say they don't like the Technomancer, and some people say that they do, so it's hard to judge, to be honest. Um, but yeah, like I said, to be honest, I quite like this game. I'm just going to throw it out there right now. This is, this is pretty fucking cool right here. The Witcher in space, why the fuck not? If I could say anything, though, I really wish there was a character creation uh, tool in this game. Because, you know, with, with the being able to change armors and weapons and shit, that's all good. But without, you know, customising the character, there's a definitely a disconnect there. For me personally, and probably some other people that play this, will find that the character creation thing is really what pulls me into the game. And if there isn't one, the game lacks a massive sub substitute for it. And in this case, it doesn't have one. So, you know, you just got to fucking, you don't even get to edit the character. And that's pretty shit. I mean, that's probably why they added it in, in the Teclamant, to be fair, you get to edit the first character. It says character creation, but it's basically just editing, we've been over this one before. So, uh, yeah. They learned their lesson, but hey, hey, too far, too now. fucking late. To kind of wish shit. it was in this one, to be honest. Would've made, would have made it a lot much better. Even though shit, I'm quite enjoying it regardless, I can still tell you there's some shit bits in it, like no character creation. That is a massive one. But, like I said, going time's going to be able to tell if if it's a really good game so far. I think it is, but you know, by the end of the video, I might not fucking like it. Who the fuck knows? I mean, hopefully, by the end, I will still like the game, because at, at the moment, I really do. I think it's pretty damn fucking good. Now, I've only had two fucking fights so far, so it's not exactly 100% good, but I like the aesthetic. The aesthetic of being on Mars is badass. It kind of makes me want to kind of check out the Red Faction games, but I don't really know. 
haven't seen any models so far in the game that I'd like to rip out of it though. No aliens or no creatures or some shit, so that's a bit, a bit of disappointment. I could always rip the main character out of the game, I suppose, this Roy. But, uh, meh, at best. Let's have a look where we're going. The mess. It looks like we're going in the right direction, doesn't it? I don't fucking know, though. I think I'm going in the right way. I'm not entirely sure, but I think I'm going the right way. Okay, let's have a look. We're not wanting to go to the mess, are we? Fuck. It's the crater we've got to go to. Got myself all fucking confused there. That's alright. It's okay, we know what the fuck we're doing. I think. The fuck are they? Nothing to do there right now. Well, we can't do fuck all, but they're like whole little zombie people. Are they dead? They look kind of dead. All right, well, fuck that then. I have to admit, I do kind of wish I was playing as the other guy, that innocence, you know, because he seems, you know, more of the sort of character I'd want to play as rather than this rough and tumble guy that you always fucking play as. Like literally every game has this in. This is basically just Witcher on Mars. That's a good fucking uh, thing for that, actually. Statement. Play Mars Warlords. It's basically the Witcher on Mars. Is it Witcher 3 on Mars or Witcher 2? So far, I'd say Witcher 2 because, you know, Witcher 3 was fucking badass. So, who the fuck knows? Oh, you can't attack NPCs. Fuck's sake. Oh, man, you lose points for that game. You lose fucking points right there. Jesus Christ. We have to look at what creatures are in this game as well. If there's any aliens, you know I'm always up for that fucker. I'll rip them straight out of this bastard. But if there isn't, then probably this won't be one that I'm ripping, to be honest. I did download, uh, what was it? Spider-Man Web of Shadows as well, that's installed. And, uh, yeah, I was thinking maybe doing the Sam Raimi skin mod. Where you play as, well, it's still Spider-Man, but it's in the Raimi movie costume. And that's pretty fucking sweet. You know, the Tobey Maguire one. Uh, I might do that, but I'm not too sure yet. I've got a lot of things in the pipeline. I think I'm maybe Legacy of Cain. Uh, Blood Omen 2, possibly. But, once again, it's in the fucking pipeline. I don't know if it's, if it's going to be tomorrow, or today, who the fuck knows. Could be a week, a year from now, who the fuck knows. I have to admit, though, you know, I am kind of liking this game. I did see a review for the sequel, the Technomancer, apparently that's a load of fucking shit, so I'm not supposed to be checking that one out, but I might do anyway, because fuck it, why not? What the fuck was the point of that tiny little cutscene? I mean, those people there are obviously Technomancers, and what the fuck Move is this though? That looks kind of fucking cool, I could rip that fucker out of here I suppose. I mean, that's kind of why I play video games these days. Not just to fucking um, experience the story, but also to rip models out of games. I'll play a game and I see a fucking cool model, like an alien or a creature, and I'm like, I'm ripping that motherfucker. Fuck off, jackass. Shove your head right up your own asshole. What do you want? It's a shop. Yeah, it's a shop. Okay. So far, I've had to say, would I recommend this? I would definitely say, yeah. You know, the storytelling's got some good points. You know, it's not 100% fucking a badass game, is it? You know, there's some, there's definitely some issues with it. No character creation. Is that an issue? Is that just a choice? I would personally consider that an issue because in a game like this, you know, it, it could do with it. Really bring you into it. I mean, even the fucking sequel has it in, so you got to know that. What'd you do before the war? I, 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 I nothing sp 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 special, sir, 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 sir. Great. Look, answer yes or no. It'll go faster. You good with your hands? N not, not, not r real. I said yes or no. Can you write? N n no, Sarge. All right, buddy. Look, I'll put you in the kitchen and you'll peel boots. That'll do just fine. Next. First name, last name, former job. Innocent Smith, apprentice electrician. Innocent? Shit, I'll never get used to these names. 
Sorry, buddy, but your innocence doesn't stand much of a chance around here, if it's not already gone. Apprentice electrician, you said? You start learning the job? Really? Yes, Sergeant. I'd probably be an electrician today, but the war... Fine, fine. We'll put you in the power plant. For once, we'll have somebody remotely qualified for it. All right, next. Poor kid. Those Aurora bastards take him young. First name, last name, for... Hey, you're not new. Roy Defiance or something like that. Temperance, actually. But don't sweat it. I never got used to it either. What do you want? Didn't we already give you something to do? Yeah, you did. I unload equipment crates. But I heard you need more people for the cleaning. Yeah, that's true. And you're good at fighting, right? They say you kicked the shit out of the fat guy. Can't say he didn't deserve it, though. You know, the last guys who went down there didn't come back in good shape, right? I know, but moving crates is boring me shitless. Some action would be a nice change. Very well. I'll reassign you. Go talk to the guards at the top of the drilling wall. But don't come bitching to me if you're missing an arm when you come back up. Next. Oh fucking righty then. So got objective, got a gold to the elevator, we can fuck off. Nice. Which way is the fucking elevator though? I mean there should really be like a mini map in the corner. Yeah, I'm kinda used to that on most games like Saints Row and fucking GTA. Ah shit, another cutscene. Hang on then. If I've got this right, you're gonna play hero against the monsters. Try to get back in one piece. That's the plan. Don't worry about it. And I'm not the Lone Ranger type. Try to look around without getting caught and we'll meet up again tonight. Wait, I was just wondering. What's your reason for doing all this? I mean, it's not like they're planning on keeping us here forever. My deep sense of patriotism? No, actually I can't stand being locked up and doing the dirty work for the guys I was fighting not so long ago. I'd kind of like to disappear into thin air, you know? I understand that. Yeah, okay, uh, I'll see you this evening. Is it done? Yeah, it's done, nice one. Right then, innocence has left. But he, he definitely lost his fucking innocence, no doubt about that one. Paul! You one of the new cleaning recruits? Yeah, I've been to the recruitment office and they gave their approval. Hey, aren't you the guy who fought with the Fat Ones gang and nearly killed them? Yeah, too right, I did that fat prick fucking deserved it. Dirty ass raping bastard. About to attack one of the kids that just got here. I couldn't just stand back and watch. Oh yeah, real hero, right? Well, you're gonna get some real good training down there. But watch it, the moles are pretty aggressive these days. Take a gum from the counter at the back and try to take out as many as possible. Then, try to get back in one piece. <laughs> It'll make a change. Hey, good luck. Okay then, so now we get a gun. Sweet. I wonder what type of guns we got. I'm kind of hoping they're laser guns or something like that. It's Mars, so I'm, I'm going to imagine mining tools for some reason. Definitely get the red faction vibe from this. I can't get, get a gun. Ah, right, okay. Here, the charges are fully loaded, so you shouldn't have Give me any the gun, you bastard. The but if you come Let's across see what the we guys, we've got to fight squad. moles, Once actually. Didn't come back up, I mean. It's not. Take too bad, I suppose. Bring them back to me, I think they're kind of like the moles from fucking all right, Fallout no, on all fours, or they're Perfect. gonna be some kind of deviation. Hurry up. The others are waiting. Personally, I kind of hope it's a deviation on it. It's not just your general fucking moles. That kind of pretty boring, if I'm honest. Um, but yeah, you know, so far so fucking good. Let's just hope that it continues. And with a game like this, that'd be brilliant. So far, I've really fucking enjoyed it. And here we go. Weapons for the battle. Find a way. Pick up three weapons from the previous squad. Okay, we'll get you fucking weapons. They give us some good shit in return, you cunt. Let's have a look. Can we change our fucking gear by a chance? Worn clothes. Oh, right, okay. Now we actually look like a prisoner. No, I want, I want the prisoner outfit. What the fuck are you doing, game? There we go. Have we got it? I think I've got it. Sweet, we're a prisoner! 
Don't fuck with us in here, lad. Fucking have you. Cunt. This definitely makes me want to play Mad Max, though. So that might be what I'll be doing on my channel. I'm not entirely sure. If I end up playing it, it'll be a video. If I don't end up playing it, it won't be a video. Pretty much straightforward. Where the fuck do we go? Are you? You need to talk to you? No? Where are you guys? You gonna talk to me? Alright, okay, you're talking. I always gotta be hungry, don't I? Or I'd never go down there. Are you serious? If that's the only reason, you should have maybe stood back. I hope you know how to use that thing. Them bugs don't just dance. I know, that's what's freaking me out. You see those guys that came back up? No, and I prefer it that way. <laughs> At least I'm not shitting myself like you. Now, it'd be real nice if you could stop giving us all the creeps. All right, whatever. Just don't expect me to go first when we get there. Right. This way we can take care of the nests by ourselves and get the bounty. Bounty? They didn't tell you? There's a bounty if you destroy the nests. Guards will give you extra stuff. So far I haven't heard a lot of squads getting that far, but hey, you can always dream, right? Hey, come on boys, we got this. We ain't no fucking pussy, we got this in the bag. Let's go kill these motherfuckers. Sobriety and courtesy. These names are fucking weird. I agree with the main character. You know, Roy's, Roy's got it down. Why the fuck have a, a shit name like that? Pick a normal name. Sobriety. The fuck? Nail them all. You now have a nail gun. Oh, sweet. Tap this menu. Press Q to open tap menu and use your available items and skills. You can also assign to the shortcut keys. Okay. I'll do that. Give me the gun. Nice. Oh shit. Shit. So those are the moles then. They're kind of cool. Definitely deviations. I'm happy about that. Let's fucking do this. How do we shortcut these fuckers? What do we do? do I click it. Oh, right. Okay, I got it. Dozy bastard, I am, I swear to God. <laughs> Don't want to do it like this. What the fuck? Go back to normal. Go back to fucking normal. What? Oh, there we go. Alright, let's fucking do it. Die, you cunt. Fucking have it. Know your enemy. The foes all have different tactics depending on their type and equipment. Check in the fights and up in the blah 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 tab. Fuck you, then. <laughs> so these are Nessa, aren't they? Okay. Well, I can't really be that fucking tough. It didn't take that much, did it? How much are you, are you guys fucking possible, or something? Come on, we got this. Don't be a pussy about it. Let's fucking have it. What the fuck so are you doing? Picked up These one weapon. Nice, we got one of them weapons. We need another two and get some good shit. Said if we came across the last squad, we should look Hopefully, for anyway. It says that you get some good shit, but it might just give you a fucking weapon or something. I'm kind of looking forward to maybe get in a different set of armor. You know, possibly like a t-shirt and jeans sort of combo. That's that's what I like to go for in these sort of games. Something that I can see myself actually wearing in real life so I can put myself into the character's shoes a lot easier. Oh shit! You big bastard, fuck off. You fucking cut my sentence off, prick. Have it. Have it, you bastard. You stole my kill. You little bastard. Who are you? Are you courtesy? Courtesy to fuck off. Pick up three weapons. We've got two now. Look, that little fucking prick. I can't believe he, he took our kill. What's a knobhead? You fucking Jackie. Jackie. Fucking twat bag. <laughs> the fuck's a Jackie? Jesus Christ. I found bones. Oh yeah, you're going to find bones in a fucking cabin. i got to be honest, if I was in any cabin and found any bones... I would shit him. Not gonna lie, and make myself out to be more badass than I am. I'd fucking shit him. I don't know what I'd do, but I'd definitely fucking like get the fuck away from there. Yeah, that's about it. Speak to Courtesy. You can fuck off. Courtesy's a robbing bastard or sobriety. I don't know which one it was. Any 
Any more you things to kill? Was that it? Oh, come on, man. Oh, wait. Big open area. That means enemies. There we go. Let's fucking do it then, you prick. Come on, what you got? You got nothing, you little bastard. Fuck off. Oh, you little bastard. Fuck off. Get away from me. Wow, I'm gonna fucking nail you, little cunts. Fuck off. Jesus Christ. Come on. Kill the fucker. Kill him. Have him. Have the prick and fucking stick him. Stick his own head up his fucking ass. Yeah, fuck off. You ain't got nothing on me. I'm more badass than you can possibly understand. Yeah, fuck all you. But we've only got 28 health now. That, that could pose a problem. How are we even healing this game? Does it just... Oh, right. It goes up then, does it? I think it goes up over time. That's okay, I suppose. But a bit weird as well, because, you know, I've been playing a lot of realistic games lately. It doesn't have that in it. Hey, guys. You see that? And... Don't feel like you're letting us do all the dirty work, huh? Not like we need a distraction, you know? Seriously, look! Looks like some metallic stuff down this hole. That's the Bugs Tunnels. Far as I know, they don't use metal for supports. That's fucking weird, man. Almost looks like preterm oil shit. Stuff built by the colonists. Holy shit! You sure? Relics? I said almost. We gotta go back up fast and tell the guards. We'll get triple rations. You sure got a problem with food. I'm with you on that, though. And anyway, who knows what's down there? Better we tell them to go down and see for themselves. Ah, come on, don't be a pussy about it. Let's go down that fucking hole. Where's that fucker gone? I won't go down, I won't see where the fuck it is. Bit of some kind of technomancer shit. Let's grab this first. Right, let's go. Where's that fucking hole at? There it is. Right, I'm off. See you Get later, dickheads. Oh, fuck off. No way. Really? Okay, you okay. impede my progress? What a prick. When we're back up top anyway. But we're not done down here. Ah, fuck it. We'll go tell the guards so, like pusses. Let's get this over with and then go talk to them. Jesus Christ, right, okay. But 99 health, so that's pretty good. 100 health, nice one. So it does go up over time. I'm, I should have fucking noticed that before now, really. But you know, better late than never. No, I have to admit, really fucking enjoying this game. You know, this is definitely gonna, it's earned a place on my fucking desktop. I don't usually fucking put many games on my desktop. Because I'm constantly installing and deleting, but this one I think I'll keep up there along with Get Out of Hell. Because you know it's a good game to put on when you just want to fuck around. I did eventually delete The Witcher, you know, I didn't want to, but it was so fucking much in size was so much. And it's easier to delete that one thing than delete loads of other things. So I thought, fuck it, why not? Barely played the fucker anyway, so fuck it. It was alright just for the mod though, definitely. That Batman mod, that was fucking fantastic. Oh shit! You cunt. Fuck off. This must be like fucking hell. It's tearing us the fuck up here. Go on then, get your fucking boys. Come on, have it, you dickhead. Fuck off. Jesus Christ, we've been told to shit. Where's my boys at? The fuck you doing? Sobriety, get the fuck over here. Courtesy, where are you fucking. You stupid cunts. Jesus Christ. Oh man, what a bastard. I'll tell you what, I really fucking enjoyed that. This has earned a place on my desktop and definitely a recommendation from me. Please fucking like and subscribe to the video. And you know, once again, I've been me and you've been you. Thank you so much for joining me on my gaming series. Please join me next time for something else. Bye-bye for now.